Hello and welcome to the show. We are here today with a very spe- I don't know what is going on here. It's a very special Survive the Hunt that's mildly terrifying out the front of the cars. Um, this is a much requested, possibly one of the most requested videos uh, for my channel because we have got a special guest. Bruffy is here and going to be trying to survive with us. Hello. Hello, everybody. I'm, you're, I'm, I'm, you're currently getting a uh, bit Yeah, mobbed. this is a bit scary to start. This is, <laughs> this is not a very nice introduction to my first it's not, <laughs> it's not. Someone has got in the back of my car as well. I'm going to get... Actually, no, it's not Lado. I don't even know who has got in my car. Uh, the aim of the game is, is very simple, in case people might not have seen this before. Uh, actually, you know what? Everyone can stay in my car. Uh, can you kick people out of cars while it's in motion? Yeah, uh, you definitely I can. I think that's a great idea. Okay. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh, no, wait. I selected... I pre okay, I, did, I, really had to, I thought I had to confirm it. The aim of the game is uh, we are going to try and survive for 24 hours of GTA 5 time uh, while this lot of incompetent fools are going to hunt us down. Um, if you want to get in your car, I think we are ready to All go. Right. We will start. I wanted to keep my helmet on as long as possible. Uh, uh, right, let us... Um, Begin, I guess. Let's go. If you want to run some people over, that's fine. There no, you, were, you were nice. <laughs> oh, there was nice someone in them. my car as well. Cheeky. Oh, the sneaky. <laughs> they always try. They always try. So far, they've never actually made it into the city in a car yet. Um, <laughs> I think Lado was the first one to try it, and it's it's caught on a little bit. Quite word. Uh, yeah. Um, so, do you have any cunning plans for for this? Well, I did a little bit of research, uh, and I, I, I've gotten myself a different outfit that I'm going to change into as soon as we get stopped um, to try and blend in as much as possible. That's why I wanted to stay in my helmet so they couldn't see me. I've changed my hairstyle. I've changed my beard that I would normally have if anybody ends up <laughs> recognizing me from that. They won't be able to. Oh. You know, you know what you're doing. You've got the uh, the proper the proper tactics down. So beyond that, though, on nothing. <laughs> beyond that, okay. It's it's always interesting to see what people end up doing this who haven't done this before. I mean, you know, I've done many of these by now, and I have the idea, you know, my ideas. And whenever we have guests, they always come up with something different that I've not thought. Oh, okay. Of, uh, which is which is the joy of this, and I'll be curious to see what you do end up going for. Um, now, of course, as you can see on my screen, and you can see on Bruffy's, it'll be the same for the hunters. There is no map, and there is no name of the players. So this is all a game about stealth. Uh, we're going to be trying to blend in uh, with traffic. We can go our own ways. We can go wherever we want within the city limits. We don't have to stick together. It's kind of a little bit of a competition to see who can survive longest, but we'll be kind of working together as well. Um, I don't know what I'm going for here in terms of a car. I just followed you so to start off with. <laughs> just, just, you know, just, you know. See, see where you end up, and I'll hopefully be in a good yeah, place. Yeah, I'm, I'm not, I'm not sure where I'm really <laughs> planning to go with this one. I'm looking for something fast, but so I'm looking for something fast, but it's not too crazy fast. So, we have this supercar rule. This is in effect. Essentially, if we drive something like a Sultan or a 9F or something very, very quick, the hunters will then have access to these supercars. Up until that point, they're not allowed to. So we kind of want to go for something that's quick without being super fast. Uh, I'm looking at Zions. They're tempting at the moment. Uh, you see, you'd probably know even better than me about what cars are fast and what aren't. I mean, I've just found a, a Sabre Turbo, which I feel like is is not a bad shout. A Sabre Turbo is not a terrible shout. It's um, the, the one downside, one thing you've got to be careful of, is rear-wheel drive. Uh, rear-wheel drive is a hindrance here because you can get pit manoeuvred uh, very easily. Yeah, that's true. So it's not the grippiest car careful. in the world. Um, yeah, um, it's why I don't like Futos. Not that Futos are spawning in this spawn set particularly, but um, yeah, a Futo, for example, can be spun out so yeah. easily that it's a bit of a problem. My, my, I've, 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 uh, I've gotten rid of my Omnis, by the way. My Omnis has gone. I've returned it to storage, uh, so they won't even know have... at least where we've, where we've gone, hopefully. Yeah, I'm going to do a similar thing and hide the bright orange estate car, because <laughs> that's, yes, rather a giveaway. Uh, and now we are... So we get a two-minute head start. Uh, the hunters have left the docks uh, right about now. Uh, they'll be blasting into the city. They will have a blimp for air support that is weirdly threatening when you see it sort of slowly floating oh, around. Yeah, can, it's surprisingly effective. Like, we laugh and we joke about it because it's a silly vehicle, but it is actually useful in the chases. They, it can do a very good job of keeping up uh, when, when it needs to. Uh, so, yeah, that'll... I've got to How say, are we making an this is so strange. This is my first taste of actually, you know, stopping for traffic in, in GTA <laughs> Online. In nine years of this game, this is the first time I've ever had to do that. 
<laughs> you are about to learn all the weird quirks of the AI that you don't normally see because you don't normally ever have to. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. They are going to do so many things that are going to drive you mad. I saw on um, one of your videos that, they, that, that if the, one comes up behind you, that can be trouble because they just try, oh, they yes. don't notice that you're there or something like that. They just drive past you. Yeah. They, they basically don't expect ever for a player to be stopped at a, at a set of yeah. red lights. So they don't react to you like a car. So they'll try and overtake you and they'll try and sit beside you at, at traffic lights. And of course, as soon as a hunter sees that, they know what's going on. Yeah. Uh, now, if you want to be brave, you can try and pretend to do that to AI cars if there are hunters around. Um, <laughs> That's like some 200 IQ kind of move. Yeah. Like, personally, I've never felt it worthwhile because if I go and do that, the hunters are going to go and look, oh, I've seen my first hunter. Oh, Hello. Already. There's a truck with red lights uh, whizzing around. Um, but yeah, you can try it, but the hunters are going to look at that interaction. And, okay, they're not going to be specifically looking at the car that's kind of pulled alongside, but they're still looking in that area. Yeah. It just draws attention. My, my opinion is it draws unnecessary attention. Uh, it could work, though. And that's the thing with these strategies. They could work in the right... You know the right instances. I've played dead and got away from chases when they when they've had big crashes and the thought I've been an AI dead in the car. But it doesn't always work. Yeah. So yeah, you've got to kind of pick and choose your uh, your strategy moments. Uh, where whereabouts are you at the moment? Just out. In I'm Europe? actually I'm driving around the outside of the the university building. Okay. Um, behind this Zion that seems to like breaking quite heavily. <laughs> Yeah, oh, you are in for a treat with all the weird <laughs> AI. It's, if you've never done this, you will see so much, so many strange quirks. I am currently still, I've still got this truck with red lights buzzing around, um, and there's another car with red lights. Uh, I'm currently by, you know, where the big fancy shops are that have the adder spawn in single player. I don't know a better way to describe them. Yeah, 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 um, like the the high end, yeah. fancy jewelry places and whatnot. Yeah, that's the one around around that area. There is a couple of hunters. Um, okay. A couple of the faster hunter cars, I think, actually, are about uh -oh. this bit. Um, I, I'm, I'm realizing that I'm driving towards that area <laughs> now that you're mentioning that. So let's just drive away, shall we? Let's go towards the beach. <laughs> yeah, that's probably not a, not a bad shout. I'm trying to have a look to see the blip. Now, of course, the hunters are restricted in terms of weaponry. We are not. If there is a chance, because there is two of us, if there is a chance and people are distracted, I will potentially try and take down the blimp with a rocket launcher, homing missiles, etc. Uh, okay. uh, because if I can knock that out of the game, it's really, really useful. The problem is, is in trying to take it down, you basically set up a big beacon of yeah, he is yeah. a person because they got the trail from the rocket. There's quite yeah. the I've another hunter drive past so me. There's quite a few cars around this. I haven't seen anyone yet, which is kind of <laughs> nice. You know, it's easing me into it. I haven't had yeah. that initial heart attack of, oh my God, that's someone, <laughs> but... Yeah, it's sometimes better to get out of the way early because, like, I can, when you yeah. can see a hunter, I know where they are. I can deal with that. Is when you yeah. can't see them is when <laughs> yeah. you don't know what they're up to. Yeah. Uh, yeah, well, we're by. I'm by the. Although I probably am in a bad place, so I'm by the shopping center area. I'm heading towards the shopping center area now. Um, one of the things that we do find, of course, is the hunters might have a car that they like, and if they ding it up a few times, they go to repair it. So we're allowed to visit Los Santos Customs if we want. Uh -huh. But the hunters go there to fix up their car. You quite often just accidentally run into a hunter there if you go to it. So it, oh, okay. it can be useful. You can make your car faster, but you might go in there and find a hunter. So Yeah, okay. Uh, it's kind of best to avoid the places where anyone might actually want to be. <laughs> yeah, potentially. Like, again, it's like a big risk versus reward. Yes, I could go in there yeah. and get a turbo on my car and make it really fast and make it difficult to catch. Um, oh, you stupid AI... I've just been cut up by an AI car right in front of a hunter who didn't pay any attention. Thank God for that. <laughs> they are going to look back at that and be annoyed with themselves at missing that. Um, but oh, the tension is raising now. Like I haven't seen anyone, but I'm just <laughs> waiting for it. <laughs> the longer you go without seeing, like for me, I've seen so many bloody hunters already. It's like I'm, I'm already in the zone. The longer you yeah, go without yeah. seeing them, it, it, it the more nerve wracking it gets. Um, I mean, yeah, like I, I've pretended to be an AI a fair few times now. I, I think I know roughly how to get away with it. Um, but for you, it's going to be your first put to the test when a hunter comes past. And like, right, is this <laughs> yeah. car driving? Yeah, uh, yeah. In, in the right manner. Uh, I mean, the good news is and also, the AI are like, I, really weird. So you will get away with doing weird stuff. Right, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm kind of worried about that, like, the moment 
if I get caught and pinned and I have to get out of my car. <laughs> I am so bad with guns. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All I do in this game is drive. Yeah, me too. Me, me, me too. <laughs> the, uh, like, the, honestly, the getting out of the car bit is the desperation play. Yeah, yeah. You do have a lot greater firepower than them, it is true. Um, so you can actually kind of scare them off because they don't necessarily... Like, if they pin you and you get out of a car quick enough... They don't actually want to be in that position because they're, if there's only one of them, they've not got the firepower yeah. to deal with it. Um, I've seen the blimp. Oh, have you? Whereabouts <laughs> I, is the blimp? I see it. It's kind of like in the center of the city, really. It's quite low. Uh, yeah, they do often. I, was, I almost got caught out. I was looking for a blimp and missed the traffic lights going green. Um, yeah, so the blimp will sit quite low. It'll hover because it's trying to check um, like junctions. One of the things the blimp can do uh, is if it hovers really low in a junction, it can freak out AI cars. So sometimes they will hover it low to see who runs and who doesn't and see how, how things act. Um, so, yeah, there may, there may come a time where you have to pretend to be a freaked out AI. They're always fun. I've, I've <laughs> tried see. it a few times. It's, I see. I've got away with it once, but more often than not, it doesn't work. Um, yeah, it's yeah. really difficult to pull off. I'm, I'm trying to see that blimp. If I can take it out early, it would be helpful. Because uh, it's just one less thing to worry about. Um, but I can't actually see it. I'm starting to see other people, hunters, as other AI. Like I, I know that it's an AI. It's just the way <laughs> that it's being a bit crazy on a single corner. It was in the distance. And it's like, okay, well, was that a person? No, uh, it probably wasn't. But you have <laughs> I'm second-guessing myself. You have got the paranoia. The paranoia is... Yeah. You've got to that stage now where the paranoia <laughs> is setting in. You're second-guessing everything. <laughs> Um, yeah, I think a lot of the hunters have red headlights because this will be going out Halloween time. So I think a lot of the hunter cars have red headlights. What are you, bloody AI, not knowing how to do lanes and traffic? I've been cut up twice already. Um, they are just being useless. Um, thankfully, no damage on the car. Um, are you still got your what, saber? Uh, I've just gone past a. a- I can't stop and investigate further. I didn't know that there, there was like a spawn of people in a ca- like cars, like AI. There was all sorts of tuna cars and everything spawning just huh. randomly in the map in a car park. I guess there might. I've never seen that before. The only thing I can think of is I know sometimes you get those events for like um, uh, like in, is it import export where you have to steal the high end cars. Maybe oh, that's maybe. one of those. I never that's actually one. have those activated, so I don't no. know when they're when they're on. But no, I never pay any attention to them. That... It was actually it was really cool. It looked really cool, <laughs> like all these tuna cars and everything, just all these AI in a meetup. <laughs> I, I mean, I get you find weird things when you do this. You find new bits of the map that you didn't know existed or car bits. Yeah, yeah, that, that sort of stuff is cool. I mean, I guess in theory you could go and steal. I mean, you'd be very obvious. You try and steal one. Um... Oh yeah, you could steal one of those. I mean, yeah, yeah you'd yeah, you'd be obviously seen, I suppose. But yeah, there was Sultans and and like Sultan RS, I think, was one. Oh, nice. <laughs> All sorts of nice cars. <laughs> okay, there we go. Most interesting find of the day so far goes to a random <laughs> car meet. Uh, I've stopped seeing hunters, so I guess I'm relatively safe at the moment. Uh, I'm heading kind of around by Simeon's garage that that sort of area. oh that's oh of area. there's there's halloween stuff going on. yeah i think that's the ufos and that sort of things occurring uh, i haven't seen anyone yet still i, I I'm, i've still just been keeping myself oh, to myself i've seen the schwarzer that's about i think that's the schwarzer anyway yeah there's so I was so tempted by it. I saw it in fairness. I was so <laughs> tempted to take it. It is I'm, it's so I'm, tempting. It, yeah. But it does it does potentially give us grief later. I saw a bright orange in fairness, which was very tempting, but also very dumb. They will uh, they will a hundred <laughs> actually you could well I say you could kinda of sell me out, drive an orange car, they will think it is me, but that doesn't really help you because they'll be looking at the orange yeah, car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, either way you're you're in trouble. Uh, I I haven't put armor on. I forgot to do that. That would be a useful thing to do. Um, just in case we get into a firefight. Um, yeah, I made sure to do that before yeah. we set off, actually. Oh, yeah. Roughly more professional than I am <laughs> in, in all of this one. I mean, I gave it a little bit of thought before we went, <laughs> but I, 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 I still have no actual thoughts of yeah. strategy. Wait, is that a person? Is that you? 
I'm I'm down by the construction site by Simeon's garage. So oh no, that wasn't you. I think that me. was a person. Though. Is that two people? Or is this AI? It might be the AI just going crazy. Actually, <laughs> see the paranoia. It's, it's so <laughs> it's powerful. All the paranoia. It's so powerful. <laughs> I mean, it could be. So the hunters do sometimes. This is a tactic. They do sometimes intentionally, and sometimes it happens by accident. But they do sometimes sort of work in pairs or in sort of little teams of two or three. Um, mm. partly because it's more useful if you happen to find if they spot one of us and they're on their own it's actually really difficult to deal with and if we get away quickly they're kind of screwed um, yeah yeah but if they're in little groups it's a bit easier also sometimes they just end up joining up by accident because you know they see another car they you know they're talking away and they go oh let's go investigate let's go you know mess around and they just end up getting stuck together for a little while so you are likely to see them in uh, sort of close proximity and small yeah. groups uh, from time to time. I have seen a bike, uh, which I'm half tempted to get on as a tactic. Um, bikes, very fast, very agile, very difficult to stop. However, oh, I've just seen a hearse drive past. Uh, that's definitely one of them. Uh, however, of course, they know that I do that sometimes, and if you are, if they see a bike stopped at a set of lights, they will knock them over. So yeah, just regardless at this just, point. Anyway, they, they, it's, it's worth yeah. it because they're so difficult to catch if they run away that they're just going to yeah. knock every bike over. So again, it's it, like a bike for me nowadays is really a... I'm in a chase, I've had to abandon my car and I need to get away. If there's a bike like easy to get, I'll grab it because they can't catch it and then I'll ditch it once I'm away because it's so difficult. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, it's so difficult to keep it incognito. Um, I'm seeing a lot of hunters at the moment. I mean, they all must be around you. I, I have, I'm still convinced <laughs> I haven't seen any. I mean, I might have seen two, but they were in fairly uh, inconsequential cars. So yeah. Yeah, it, it, it might have just been AI. It probably, probably was AI just farting around. Um, yeah. I mean, so far, I think the Schwartz is the most fearsome car that I've come across if it was to give chase um, the hearse I'm not too fussed about I am so another thing to be careful of that I'm about to go and do which is not very clever uh, be wary driving past police stations uh, because we're in stolen cars drive past a police station uh, sometimes okay, yeah. if there are cops spawned you get a wanted level and they shoot at you and they kind of ruin your day that's a dead um, giveaway I suppose <laughs> it's a dead giveaway your car has bullet holes in it maybe a smash yeah. window uh, yeah you don't want um, you don't want that basically um, now we can call Lester we can remove a wanted level but you're still going to have a time of frantically faffing about trying to deal with everything um, so yeah have to be a little bit wary of those uh, I am going to have to put my roof down soon otherwise I'm going to no don't do it AI uh, I'm going to start being suspicious because I've got the roof up on this I don't know what time the AI normally take the roof down so... oh uh, no there's a, there's a fella next to me that has the roof up still so you're alright at the minute Ah, that is, that is <laughs> the bloody demon trucks turned up again I've seen the demon truck about four times now you had a look and just oh, drove is that off. the new event? There's the Cerberus. Uh, no, no, this is one of the oh, hunters. This... They, they, I don't know what oh, it well, is. Oh, in the right. They got okay. they got red lights on a raptor looking truck. So I just call right, it everything okay. with the red lights a demon something. Uh, <laughs> gotcha, it kind gotcha, of looks like that gotcha. when it's giving chase. That's fair. I'm around the Maze Bank area right now. Uh, just there's just no, uh, not Maze Bank. Sorry, the Maze Bank Arena. Oh right, okay, yeah. I am, I am by, because I'm not far away from the Maze Bank area itself. Um, so yeah, like that kind of area is fairly safe. Uh, the only downside, of course, is there's not that many ways in and out of it. So if you do get spotted, you're in a bit of trouble. Oh yeah, that's there. a fair point that I'm only realising right now as you've mentioned it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like the airport is really safe in as far as they don't often go out that way. Problem is, when they yeah. do, and if you get seed out that way, you're kind of in trouble because there's literally two ways in and out. Yeah. Oh, roofs are going down, so I'll take the roof off this eye on. I think that might have been my my uh, strategy so far. I've been in fairly inconsequential areas where they're not going to think I was going to be, but if I get seen, <laughs> yeah, it, <it's, laughs> I'm going to be in trouble. It's that risk versus reward uh, sort of thing. Yeah, you might get away with not getting spotted. However, if they do check, uh, then... Yeah, you could be in, you could be in trouble. Um, I've been in the fairly busy areas, fairly central areas for a lot of this. I still haven't actually seen the blimp, so my plan of shooting it down is not really working. I just saw the blimp really close to me. It was like the the tiniest little in my peripheral vision, and then I disappeared again. So I have no idea where it's gone. Ah. It was, 
It was right next to me, though. <laughs> but it's surprisingly difficult to keep track of a blimp, despite the fact it's bloody massive. You, re- <laughs> yeah. like, you should think it should be the easiest thing in the world to see, yet it is not. Um, I am going on a blimp hunting mission. I feel like we're going to play it a little bit risky. I'm driving up to a car park roof. Um, How does it go? How, are there any rules around, like, literally just hiding? Uh, like, so yeah, you know. we're not allowed to camp. We're not allowed to just sit in one yeah. area and stay stationary. Mostly because it makes a really boring video. That um, makes sense. <laughs> uh, however, you are allowed. Like for example, if you're in a chase, you are allowed to hide. You know, if you if you bail out of a car and end up stuck somewhere, you are allowed to hide. Um, in in that situation, like I'm, yeah, I, yeah, I can go on a hunting mission and sit on a car park roof and look desperately for a blimp that I can't see. Um, yeah, I have no idea where the blimp is now. How is that I, blimp I, being this invisible? <laughs> uh, Olympus? I've not seen you the entire time. Well, this has been a waste. Now, unfortunately, I've got myself in a bit of a pickle here because to get out of a car park, I have to do something that the AI don't often do. I have to hope no hunters are around. Because uh, AI cars do leave car parks, but it's rare. So if a hunter sees a car mm. leave a car park, they will go and check it. So yeah, instant, it's, instantly thought about. Yeah. It's an instant suspicion, even though yeah. it is a legit AI thing. It's still just an instant suspicion. So yeah, I'm gonna end up doing this and hope no hunters about. Uh, yeah, I can't see the blimp at all. I mean, where it's gone. Uh, so yeah, from a car park roof, I can see a lot of the city, and I can't see the damn thing. So it's surprising. maybe he's landed. Possibly, surprisingly well hidden. Uh, right, let's get onto this road quickly back to blending in uh, for a second I thought that was one of them but it was just an AI hummer we are all good well that was a whole bloody demon truck is about oh there's mayhem at an end what is going on here I think I just oh they've murdered an AI car well that AI is <laughs> having a bad day <laughs> I think they freaked out an AI to the point where the AI got out of the car, got back in the car, drove off, and they decided to run the car off the road and flipped it. Um, <laughs> for good measure? I don't quite know what was going on there. Um, I'm taking taking uh, um, a sort of a, your advice of the fact that the places I've been, probably not the best in terms of actually being able to get out, so I'm, I'm, I'm going more into the city a bit more <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> Just to give myself a fighting chance if I get seen. Lots of escape routes is helpful. Um, yeah. It's, yeah, you are more likely to get seen and get in a chase, but you're also more likely to be able to get away. Um, I, uh, to be I, honest, at this point, I just want to see someone. <laughs> I, don't know how I want to get it over with. I'm sick of this feeling, this paranoia. Yeah. That every car is a, is a, is a hunter. Uh, oh, there's buses spawning. I'm half expecting. So they do sometimes do this. Grab a bus, for example, because you're never going to really look at a bus. And if there's a chase and a bus does manage to intercept you, it is going to wreck your car and can pin mm. you. And there's so many spawning, I'm really expecting someone to try it. Um, so I'm always wary even though they're not the best pursuit vehicles by a long way I'm always very wary oh there's the blimp ah where, where is said blimp oh missed my light bloody hell um. <laughs> got it yes <laughs> <laughs> nice work well done the blimp is no more Ruffy's done a better job of killing blimps oh, I've than been I have. Seen. Run! I've been seen. <laughs> Time to leave. <laughs> oh well, I mean, that, you have made your life a lot easier now. Um, you have you have made your life <laughs> ten times easier. I, I just saw the opportunity. I had to take it. <laughs> no, go for it. Uh, I am currently. I'm actually kind of currently by the maze. Back. Oh, in fact, I can I can tell there's a chase on as a hunter has just wandered past. Uh, the sort of maze bank buildings. Um, so that's the thing now. They know my car. They, so I'm going to have to like change it. Huh? They know your car. So you've got to get away, get out of sight, and then hopefully change your car. Um, you have definitely pissed them off. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> I've seen a post I've seen a postlude go blasting Wait, past. Wait, is that the cop? Oh, I think I've got cops and I, don't e I didn't even know because the hood was turned off. Ah, uh, yeah, you might. I would call Lester quickly and uh, yeah. and get rid of that. <laughs> uh, whereabouts are you? I can maybe come and try and help, um, potentially. All right, wanted level is gone. Should be 
I'm in now in a premiere. I'm at the top of the map by the oil fields. Area, oh right, the okay. Okay. Um, they they were not going that way. The ones I saw. So you might have got away. Okay. I'm might... in. I'm I'm back in. I'm in a different car. Okay. I'm I'm good. And I can't. I don't see anybody. Hey, they, well, I mean that—that that is good going. That is very good going to have uh, got the that blimp was worth gone. it. That was so worth oh, it. Oh, hundred percent, hundred percent. The blimp is one of the uh, most fierce elements. Now, they can send up another aircraft. So we've got rid of one blimp. Another player can go and grab the blimp and uh, take to the skies. But they are yeah. down. They are down a hunter now. Longbow is out. Longbow can't rejoin. So they would then oh, lose. Is that it? He, he's out? He's now. out. Okay, he's he doesn't gone. get to be... Right. Um, so if they get another aircraft, they lose a ground car. And the aircraft's never going to be able to kill you um, yeah, yeah. in a chase. So it is... Yeah, they might send another aircraft up. If they do, I'll try and shoot it down. Uh, we'll try <laughs> We'll try and get it again. Uh, we'll, we'll just play bop the, uh, bop the blimps. But... Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know where the hunters I saw were going then, if you were over that part of the map. They were, they were obviously used or something um, but yeah to manage to get the blimp and get away that quickly is definitely good going <laughs> <laughs> like that's that's, that's some, some good going in there I mean I, I saw the, there was just the fact that like there was no one around me it was fairly low risk because I was in a somewhat area of the map where I thought there wouldn't be a lot of people and I, yeah. I just had that opportunity that perfect la sight line of sight to be able to just <laughs> shoot a rocket at it and it yep. worked, thankfully. Yeah, no, it's, it's very, very good going, and has even made my life considerably easier um, in, in this one. So yeah, good, good job. Uh, I'm, I'm heading back. I mean, uh, is that? Yep. Oh, bloody hell! I saw three of them just shoot off towards the kind of my. Uh, yeah, four of them which just got off towards Michael's house, the golf club kind of area. Okay. Um, I guess it, it, it also in, in from their perspective, it can kind of be uh, if, if they're playing it smart to sort of if they see one of us, they could always pretend that they haven't and yep, get everybody to you know converge on the same location. That is another another strategy that can be employed. Uh, it's a difficult one to pull off. Basically, uh, if, if if me or you, for example, don't know we don't know we're rumbled, we're just driving around slowly. They can get a lot of people in. Um, of course, sometimes if you think you see a hunter and you think they're following you and you bolt too quickly, you could have given yourself away and they have no idea that it was you. Um, yeah, yeah. So it's yeah, it's this real game of hold your nerve, but if you hold it too long, you can get yourself in a lot of trouble. <laughs> Again, it's, yeah. what is going on? I've seen almost all of the hunters have driven past this intersection. Um, going up, well, actually they're going up towards those um, high-end shops. There is, oh, bloody hell, the hearse is searching this line of cars that I'm in at the moment. Oh. Which I don't know why, but the hearse is searching it. And the hearse is following this line of cars currently. Oh. I mean, I'm happy to, to come and assist with weapons if you, <laughs> if you feel like you need it. At I don't some know point. what this hearse is up to. <laughs> It doesn't look like it's paying. It's kind of just driven past. Um, it is sat in the intersection in front of me. This is the thing: is do I hold my nerve here and not, yeah. not know what it's doing? Is it calling in reinforcements? Um, I don't know what it's doing. It's parked on the pavement alongside me. Um, oh, someone else has just driven past. What is going now? I've got the paranoia. <laughs> What the hell is going on here? Do you bolt? Do you just go? Like, do you, do yeah. you hold your nerve? Do you stick around? Do they not see you? Do they know that it's you and they're just getting a lot of more people in? It's, well, another hunter, it's so many options. Another hunter just drove past and ignored it. So if, if they were trying to check if it was me, I think they would have at least had the other hunter have a look, which makes me think that they were just in that area. Um... Found, uh, I'm going to get myself in trouble because I've driven past the hearse again. But I am in like a beige coloured Zion that, let's face it, is not exactly the most interesting car in the world. So they might not pay much attention to it. Have you put the roof down? Yes. Yes, okay. I have put the roof down. Um, What's happening? Hey, you! Uh, I would... Uh, I don't know what to do here. 
I think it's surely like having a, a car with a roof down gives them a bit better of a chance to like see the character because I imagine even if you try to blend in, the player character still looks different to. Yeah, I mean, I change because I've changed the appearance of my character, so it doesn't really look like the normal person that I would yeah. have. The theory is that yes, it would uh, make it maybe a little bit easier, but then if I have the roof up, it's way more likely to be looked at. The AIs do sometimes yeah. drive around with the roof up, but again, it's just minimising the odds, just minimising yeah, the chances yeah. it gets seriously looked at. I'm surprised I got away with that, to be honest, because that hearse really had a good look at the car, <laughs> and just yeah i don't know i don't know what it was looking for whether it was thinking another car was doing something weird bloody hell um we are still got a decent amount of time to go <laughs> oh we do we still got like eight hours of game time left to run oh no so i'm around the casino area now i'm just in a line of traffic and i'm sort of going into the vinewood area all just... right yeah that's not, not not a bad area to head i've Looped, but I didn't intend to loop my way around. I'm still by the big Maze Bank Tower bit. Um, I just, I've just been around this part of the map. Oh, there goes the truck again. I've seen that truck a lot, but it wasn't really heading anywhere useful. Um, yeah, who knows what they're... Who knows where they're Something heading? I keep getting caught out by is uh, I, I'm, I'm stopping too early. And like the AI will go forward a little bit more, and then there's a big gap between me and the AI, uh, and it's like that is a, that is a, you know, if someone <laughs> sees that, that's so obvious that yeah, it's it's not the AI behind it. Yeah, it does rely on them paying attention, which is not always. I their suppose strong. that's it's, true. It's, yeah. it's not always yeah. their strong. <laughs> and to be to be fair to them as well, you know, you're whizzing around the city. You can't physically look at every car. Like you can't look yeah, at that's every true. little yeah. thing because there's just so much. But it is something that if they did look at, they'd probably go hmm. That seems a little bit odd. Let's go and have an investigate. And then it's how do you sort of pull that one off? Um, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to head. I'm by the, again, I'm by the big shopping centre bit now. So I will head out towards the casino. And I will. <laughs> right, okay. Here, here's the here's the mini game. Can we find each other? Um, oh, that would be good. Yeah, let's try that. <laughs> uh, so, okay, what, what, car am I, what car are you in? So I know what I'm looking I'm for. I'm in a uh, grey Premier. It's kind of like blue grey. Okay. Uh, I am by... Oh, they are going. So, I'm by the main Los Santos Customs, the one in the middle, and four, uh, three hunters are by here. Two just drove in. The pink Prioso has just driven past as well. So, that bit there is kind of unsafe. Uh, okay, say I'm, I'm, I'm north of you then. Uh, actually, a bit further, a further out, but yeah, mostly north. Alright, okay, I'm gonna head... Oh. Uh, I don't know what road this one is. I'm by that uh, that UFO um, restaurant. Oh yeah, I know the one somewhere. <laughs> you're you're on <laughs> yeah. that you're on that very yeah. top road. I, I don't yeah, know exactly yeah. where it is. I'll go try and head up that way. Um, sadly, in the wrong lane at the moment. But oh yeah, that's the trick with trying to find each other as well. That it's, it's we've got to actually follow the road signs. And yep. <laughs> yeah, you, you yeah. want to follow the road rules. You got to follow the turnings and all of that sort of stuff. Um, I'm coming down off that road now. Ah, right, okay. So towards the the shopping centre where there's a tunnel going through it. Yes. Uh, oh dear, what is going on here? The post loot. I've got a post loot alongside me checking the car. Oh no. Uh, post loot is about to try and steal my car. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that is he out of the game? He as is well? out of the game. So he wanted okay. my car. I don't think he actually knew it was me. I think he just Wait, wanted really? to steal my car. This happens. <laughs> it's rare, but it does happen. Basically, wow. they're looking for a new car um, because theirs is beaten up, or they want something faster. I'm in a half decent car. Um, no way. So yeah, they go to carjack me, and unfortunately, in this one. <laughs> yeah, I like I've got no choice in this. I either run or I shoot. Uh, yeah, and in this yeah. instance, it was a case Ooh, of you know what? Someone I'll go just for went shooting. past me. Yeah, they're they're all big truck. Oh, they're all going north. They're all going to be rushing towards me because uh, <laughs> there were other cars around at the time. Uh, oh, are you getting chased now? I am in a, I am in a chase. Yeah, they're okay. Schwarzer. <laughs> the Brioso is about. Um, I think I have just the Brioso. I think I have shaken them quite well using some alleyways. I don't know whether the Brioso would have seen me. Uh, possibly. I've got a oh muscle my God, car. I got, 
I got crashed into by one of them, and he's just gone straight past and didn't even <laughs> yeah. think. Yeah, they're, they're too busy. <laughs> they are too focused on going for my fleeing Zion at the moment. That uh, yeah, you'll get away with stuff like that. Oh, no. yeah, I should probably try to change the car though, because it's pretty. Yeah, it's got a bit of damage. Yes, you absolutely. If you get damaged, the first thing you want to do is try and get a new car, um, because if they see a damaged car. So damage doesn't always render on everyone's screen. Sometimes it's a yeah, bit funny. Yeah. But if they see a damaged car, um, they will know it's a player, basically. Uh, I think I have mostly got away, actually. Uh, oh, nice. I am now... Ooh, I'm right all the way down to the airport at the moment. Uh, I don't think anyone's following me. Yeah. <laughs> Bloody hell. <laughs> You're at the airport uh, already, well. Yeah, I, just, I kind of weave my way through some alleyways and put my foot down. There was a muscle car behind me, but it doesn't have the top end to keep up with the Zion. Yeah, yeah. So I've just gone. Unfortunately, now it doesn't mean I've got to find a new car. And uh, the airport there is crap stuff spawning. Uh, is that a Hunter? No, I don't think so. I might have to end up in a Sabre Turbo myself, having said they're not always the best. But it is the best option I've got. And hey, I managed to take out a blimp and get away in a that is true. Table, yeah. So then yeah, that is They're not too bad. That is true. Oh, do I go with a Sultan? It would break the supercar rule. Do you know what? I'm considering doing that. I was considering getting a bullet. <laughs> <laughs> just just do it. Yeah, you'll, you'll break the supercar rule, but, you know, it's at the point of the game now where they don't have a huge amount of time. Yeah, yeah. So uh, I'm going to end up smashing the window on the Sultan, though. That's the... Uh... Oh, I've seen a few crap. bullets. Um, Sultan, go, 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 go. There was a hunter, but didn't look in the right oh. car park to where I was. Oh, and I crashed my Sultan immediately because I was trying to get it off out of sight. <laughs> well, I've beans that up. I need another car. Um, there was another Sultan. There's a grey, another lighter grey one. Uh, oh, yeah. I hope there's cars in this golf course car park. There normally is. There's normally something decent around there. There's one habanero. <laughs> well, okay. Uh, take it back. <laughs> yeah, never mind. Uh, right, I am under a bridge. Oh, my car despawned stupid fast. Well, that's helpful. I'm not gonna my see. damage is so minimal that I don't think they'd even notice, to be honest. Well, the thing is, sometimes what you see as minimal damage might render on their game as a lot more. Oh, that's a good point. Um, which, is the, yeah, which is the problem. I've been caught out with a car that had essentially no damage on my screen but was missing a rear bumper on theirs. Uh, mm, and you know okay. that's that sort of stuff is a problem because um, you just never know what's going to get you caught at that stage uh, so just any damage i would generally go for a swap unless it's a really good car that you you'd, you'd take the risk of getting spotted nighttime is yeah. easier to get away with like minor damage because it's dark it's tough to see the cars um but yeah, in the well, I've, I've taken a car that was against my better judgment because it's one of the cars that i've in my G-Fred races, I, I I hate it. It does me terribly. The carbon is there. Um, okay, but it it it's a high risk strategy with the top down as well. I think. Yeah, I mean <laughs> it'll be quick. It'll be quick. There's no doubt about it. Um, Never mind. I've changed my mind. Ah, <laughs> you're not going to get carjacked. At least that would be I've the just plus point. In fairness. Ah. There we go. Oh, the guy I'm about to kick out looks almost exactly like me. Uh oh, that was it. Oh, there they are. There, there he is. Okay, time to go. <laughs> time to go. Well, that lasted oh, longer. That's a, that's a lecture. No, here we go. Here oh, we go. Dear. <laughs> All right, where are you? I might be able to come assist. Um, I just pit maneuvered a guy. Go for it. Yeah, use any any and all tactics. Uh, good thing I got a Sultan, seeing as they now know the supercar rules in effect so <laughs> yeah that's they, true they are gonna very quickly find a lot of high-end cars that we're gonna have to deal with how uh how long do we have uh so uh, a while quite a while, a while yet um i mean you've got a fast car you can keep a chase going oh, it wasn't as fast as his though uh oh <laughs> uh oh uh, uh, that doesn't sound promising no, it's not. <laughs> I've got like five of them on me. I am currently by the Maze Bank Arena. If you come down here, I can try and goad some to, to leave you alone and chase me instead. Um, I don't know what direction you'll be going from, right. but I'm, I'm going to go to the, hel I'm, sorry, I'm the Maze Bank Arena. I'm heading towards the helipads uh, area. Oh, he got me. Uh oh. Oh, this doesn't look good. This does not look good for me. Oh, I'm all right. I've got out. Oh, where, okay, where are you? I'll try and head to you. All right, I'm around the Los Santos Customs. Uh, the main one? In the, um, in the main one in the city. Uh, 
I'm on, I'm on the way. Rescue but, Sultan. Yeah. To, it's gonna head I got too greedy. I should have stuck with the carbon as a <laughs> sign in fairness, and I was happy about it. Yeah, I, that's the thing. Every time you swap cars, it's a risk. Yeah. Um, every every change of car is is a this is in high fairness risk. is is um, not good. And it's it's I'm at the base bank now, so uh, I'm kind of oh. I've got an in fairness on my tail. Oh bloody hell! I'm going back north. Are you in the red one? Yeah. I spun the green one for you. Spun the green one. Oh, is that you? That was me in the gray, gray Sultan. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. They've nice. all ignored me as well. They've oh, paid no. no attention to me. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> they just passed you completely. I spun no one of their cars out and they've just completely ignored me. They're going to think ah, I'm yes. a hunter Went straight past at me. this Beautiful. point. Um, I'm going to try. I'm going to try and just irritate. I found the Brioso. I'm now hunting hunters at this moment in time. <laughs> Uh, come here, Brioso! Uh, let's see if I can just irritate you. Because um, they, they're just going to think I'm a hunter at this point and just not pay any attention. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. No, okay, the Brioso's figured out who I am. No, no, the Brioso's just turned around and ignored me. Oh my What's god. What's going no on? <laughs> what is going on? Oh my on? god. I just did a big stunt jump into the storm drain and they're all following me. I've yeah, got they will. Four of them following me down. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, man. Uh, all right. Where can I, I. I mean, I've crashed. I've spun one and I've crashed into one and they still don't care about me. Um, <laughs> I'm not sure what I'm going to do next. Uh. I mean, I do know what I'm going to do next. Uh, oh, I found me. Lado's car. I know what I'm going to do next. I'm just going to piss off Lado, so don't don't worry about this. <laughs> um, all right, there we go. I don't know why I bother getting out of my car. Um, I'm having issues. This was not a good strategy. <laughs> are you still in this? Okay, okay, whereabouts oh, are they're you? Shooting me. They're shooting me. Oh, oh they got me. <laughs> they, um... I should have got out. Ah. Oh. Ah, damn damn it. It. I just I blew up Lado's car, they're going to know where I am now. The storm like, drain wasn't a good strategy. <laughs> I saw uh, the exit to get out and I should have taken it. Yeah, well, I actually now need a new car because mine is dented. Um, and they know where I was because I just blew up Lado's no car. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, you do, you survived a long bloody time. Uh, which is I got too greedy. I got way too greedy. I should have been happy with what I was doing. In my, I would try to spice it up a little bit, and then I, yeah. I went way too far. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's difficult. Like the, the furnace is a very good call. If you can pull that off, that's a great call. Um, unfortunately, it's just one car change too many. I, I, yeah. They see you stealing it. Is that what, what got you? Uh, yeah, yeah. They said that there was one there just as I started pulling away. So uh, yeah, you must have seen me like get into it, and then yeah. it's a bright red in fairness at that point. <laughs> yeah, that's that's that, that that'll do it. That'll do it. Um, yeah, that's that's the risk. You change car. There's always a danger that they'll see it because the animation, you know, it's not going to have you blending in. Uh, yeah. My Sultan, my Sultan is is grazed. Um, so I'm looking. Although it's going to night time, which does help me. I'm on the lookout for an Infernus or anything faster. Basically. I'm guessing I'm not allowed to uh, aid you in any way by looking no. at the map. And <laughs> no, unfortunately, you are yeah. you are out. I'm just looking for um, my own personal, uh, personal yeah, I mean, enjoyment. What you, what you can do if you want, so it's more exciting. If you go to your house, uh, you can look in the uh, TV. You can like uh, spectate players, so you can actually see what's going on uh, from oh, there. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, yeah. There's, there's normally when you're out, you go. To the, had with the uh, guests, so it's the easiest place to go. But I've, I've, I'm a little bit stuck. I know I technically broke the supercar rule going for a Sultan first, um, but I should have got all the way because now I've just seen a hunter driving around in an Inferno. I'm basically going to need an Inferno at this point. Wasn't it a green Inferno that was no, shooting the hunter? It was a black oh, one. Okay, so there, there, there's more of them then. There was a yeah. green one chasing me. That was the well, trouble. I couldn't, I couldn't get away from the yeah. other Inferno. <laughs> I mean, I, well, I spun the green one, but they got more, and it's just yeah, they got going again. Um, yeah. The plus, so the plus point I get with the Sultan and why Sultan is, is generally regarded as one of the best sort of getaway cars is all-wheel drive. And, yeah, you know, the, it's heavy, well, heavier than an Infernus. And so I can chuck it off-road and I'll be mostly okay. Not guaranteed, but mostly okay. Um, whereas the Infernus might get into trouble. Actually, is the Infernus all-wheel drive? I, I it should, is, yeah. I was going to say, I assume it is, but uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm not actually sure. Um... There is a really stupid play. If I find a bike, I might take it. 
Yeah, there have been a few bikes around, actually. I have seen a yeah. few. Cause it's, it's, I'm so disappointed in myself. Uh, I'm so be, greedy. You took the you took out the blimp. Like that's there is bonus <laughs> points. There is so many bonus points. I got points, overconfident um, for taking out the taking out the blimp. Um, yeah, it, it was just one car change too many. I mean, you it does again for 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 the audience for the viewers that, that wonder why I don't change car very often. It gives a very good demonstration of yeah, big exactly. risks that go on with it. Every time yeah. you change car, it is a risk every single time. Even when you think you're in a perfectly safe area, all it takes is one person looking the right way, come around a corner at the wrong time, and you're suddenly screwed. Um, I am having it. Oh, there's coquettes spawning. Not too bad. Uh, but yeah, the Infernus. I'm heading down to the, the pier, the car park there. I'm hoping some good stuff will be spawning in that. And it's kind of... I can swap into a car there without anyone really seeing. Uh, but they might all... The hunters also know this stuff, so you've got to be careful because you never know what they're going to be. Yeah, especially, checking. I suppose, after you've done it so many times, it becomes yeah. like meta players of who does what. Yeah, and you, exactly. Yeah. Oh, there is a car park full of bullets. I mean, ca I can't avoid. The, I've got to use that. you got to take a you bullet. Can't have, you can't have an orange and black bullet parked in a car park and me not nah, use an orange and black it. bullet. Uh, <laughs> if they see this driving around the city, I am screwed, but I'm going to use it anyway. Uh, this is this is more just for the glory at this point. Um, we are going to go for the glorious uh, orange bullet. It has got a smashed window, but I can't do anything about that. I might be able to clear it. I don't know whether that will get rid of it. Yes, it did. Awesome. I mean, the, so the one plus point I do get with this play is they don't... They will not expect me to drive an orange car because it's so obvious. Like, there's there's a little bit of them that will want to check every orange car, and there's a big bit that says, I'm not an idiot, I'm not going to go in this sort of a car. Yeah, that so, makes sense. Yeah, yeah. Like, the theory. Now I've done yeah. this every future episode, they will check every <laughs> single orange car. <gasps> yeah. Bike! Oh, do I go for a bike instead? All of the interesting stuff is turning up. Oh, which bike is it? Is it? Oh, they're good. Are they good bikes? I think they are good bikes. The higher booster looking one. I don't know anything about them. But, uh... Oh, I've got to stick with the orange bullet. I have got... Uh, what time did we set off? I think we set off at 11 o'clock, didn't we? Probably. An hour I actually didn't hours. have my phone up, so I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> I have forgotten, because I am a consummate professional. Um, <laughs> I can't remember. I'm going to go till 11 o'clock just in case, because if I survive an extra hour, then it's good for me. Uh, I'd yeah. rather survive an extra hour than survive one too little. I really oh, there we go. I'm spectating you now. That is ah. a very orange bullet. It's a very orange <laughs> car, isn't it? It's, it's a beautiful colour. It is um, beautiful. It is not a stealthing colour at all. No. But but you you're in you're in style. Exactly. And I also kind of figure if they see me at this stage of the game, they have so little time to stop yeah. me. Yeah. That as long as I can out accelerate them a couple of times, that's all that matters. Uh, the only downside is if they manage to pin the car in a corner uh, somewhere because we know they've got very fast cars at this stage. That was the problem that undid me. They pinned me at a point where I, I drove to a point where I couldn't get out of, basically. There was either water or crashed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's that's the problem. Although, one of the, one of the great escape techniques is has been used a few times is if you can drive so if you're really stuck in a chase is just drive your car into the ocean because you can get out and swim and like stay underwater and they really struggle oh, to follow I it I could have done that as well I should have done that yeah that is that I is, guess with these are the things that you learn with experience of doing this game mode. yeah or you're <laughs> desperate and it's like how on earth <laughs> yeah, could I yeah. do I, like my only yeah. option is to go swimming at this point and it kind yeah. of works so yeah that that is really that like that everything's gone horribly wrong here is what I can do sort of a plan um, I have seen a hunter driving around, and they have paid no attention to the orange bullet. No, oh, they have paid attention. Around. Here They've he paid comes. attention. Here he I'm not going to stick there. I'm not going to wait yeah. for them to check. Oh, that's a shame. Uh, that oh, was that's instant. <laughs> <laughs> they saw an orange car. They knew what I'm like. Yeah. Um, damn it. I was I was hoping they wouldn't think I'd do that, but they did. I don't even know what they're in. Is it Reinhardt they're in? Actually, uh, I, couldn't, I couldn't see actually. Um, it's shifting, whatever it is. It, it might have been like that tailgater that was chasing me for a while. Possibly, yeah. Um, it does look. Oh no, it looks quicker than that actually. Well, oh, there's a green bullet. Oh, and they've blocked oh. themselves in. <laughs> good, good work from uh, 
from them. I've got one of the red headlighted cars going on. How oh. long have you got to survive at this uh, point? I have an hour of game time. I'm going to 23 just just in case. Um, yeah, I've got an hour of game time. Oh, the, okay. Downside of the bullet does not like the bumps. Bumps are horrible. Bumps That's are mean. True. Uh, the back end is just getting launched. And what I might try is if I get to the 20, if I get a, an hour, I might try and escape. Uh, escape. Whoa! That's a good hit. Uh, Oh, we're in trouble. Oh, oh trouble! God. Oh, there's so many of them. Uh, well, like, oh, I uh, pressed to get out of car button. Uh, <laughs> no. oh, wow, I just I got pinned in the car. I couldn't even get out. Just didn't even let me get out of the car. That's the same uh, for me. That was that it's was what, impressive. You know what? Yeah, that that is. We both got too overconfident. We both wanted to go yeah. for the style. <laughs> yeah, and I probably shouldn't have driven an orange bullet. Uh, but I will say they were very efficient. At the end of that, um, you don't. Yeah, know they, they they converge on you quite well. They they, they, they <laughs> converged on it and they stopped it incredibly quickly. Um, so there we go. Well, how was your your first experience of Survive the Hunt, Bruffy? Did you enjoy it? Hey, I did enjoy it. Thank you for having me on. It was <laughs> oh. it was a lot of fun, and I enjoyed going through all the motions. <laughs> you you went through the paranoia, the acceptance, the terrified run away, and you shot the blimp. Uh, you know, very few times has the blimp <laughs> yeah. ever successfully been shot down. So well done on uh, on managing that one. Um, yeah, that was that was an awful awful lot of fun, um, and yeah, definitely a real a real challenge. I even went for the the two overconfidence at the end. Yeah, like I, I went from all, uh, the, the full <laughs> spectrum of emotions and experiences in one goal. That is, it was brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> you even got to the stage of overconfidence and getting a silly car. Um, <laughs> yeah. So you, you did the whole experience in one go. Uh, that is going to be it uh, for for this video. Thank you all very much for watching. Thank you very much to Bruffy uh, for joining us for uh, for this one. It shall be it for today. Until next time, a uh, goodbye.